Hello people, my name is Henry and I am Dutch. The Dutch cycle for commuting to school and work and Henry is not an exception here. Surely you have seen the Dutch Prime Minister Rutte on social networks on bicycle going to the parliament or even to the king. The Mandarin is much more suitable in the Netherlands than for example in Singapore. Now I'm going to talk to you about cycling in Sarawak. I live in Kuching. Sarawak, Malaysia since 2016. To get to know my new home, I cycled through Sarawak. For me, cycling is the best way to get to know a country. In all the countries that I have been, posted like Qatar, India, Malaysia, Thailand, I cycled. I am inviting all of you, yes you all down there, to cycle through this immense beautiful state, Sarawak. Cycling has got, more, has got more popular over the years in Sarawak, especially during the COVID-19 period since it was one of the few recognition activities allowed. On Sunday mornings you can see families going all over Kuching. Jarnan access to Matang is packed with cyclists even when it is raining. Now, to prove to you that I'm an engineer, here come some facts about Sarawak. Sarawak is a non-dense state non-dense populated state, one inhabitant per 20 square kilometer. That's not much. It is slightly smaller than Peninsular Malaysia. It has got four major cities where half of the three million population is living. Outside these four cities there are small villages, small cities, agriculture area and forestry. I pass through small villages where people still grow their own vegetables and keep livestock. Home cooking is still the standard there. This series of movies that I am posting is to share the beautiful trips I made with you, the community. I am inviting you, yes you down there, to come over to Sarawak and have a good look at the and experience the beauty, the variety, the nature, the sceneries, the dwindling roads and points of interest as I have done. Because that is my goal. What I have seen I want you to see as well. Singapore. Leave the East Coast. Leave Marina Bay. Leave that Cumbria jungle behind you and come over here to Sarawak and see the real thing. One day I will take you to some small roads to small villages in the interior. Another time I will take you to a waterfall or even a hot spring. We can even go to the Indonesian border on several locations. We can go to beaches in Lunde or in Damai or Miri. We can cycle to the hill where on top of it is a church. And you go by a path up to the church and then if you're really interested you can even go up to the top of the hill and have this very nice panorama view of Sarawak. Now, nah, we will, can take you to caves. I can take you to streams to swim and cool down. Meet the locals. For seasoned tour bikers, make a trip from Kuching to Miri and stay over at Homestay, which is similar to bed and breakfast. There are endless possibilities here. Do not hesitate any further. Pack your bike and come over. See you soon on the roads of Sarawak. And please do not forget to subscribe to my channel because you will miss out on the beautiful routes and points of interest that I want to share with you. Let's go through some nice pictures that I've taken on all these routes. Cheers! Dawn at Kota Samaran. Sunrise Kota Samaran. Stall selling fruits, vegetables and drinks. A view of Kuching, Sarawak River with some mountains, Trumbull Beach, a cottage close to Matang Family Park, Dwingling Road towards the hills, one of many small rivers with tiny villages, King Chan Temple. A view from King Chan Temple over Sarawak River. 
Road through the hills. A test for the cars coming up. <laughs> 